Welcome to Voice Bootcamp. Hello, my name is Faisal Khan. In this lab, I'm going to show you a customer's requirement to customize end user's mailbox so that whenever you enter, uh, create a new uh, user account of our mailbox, certain settings will be there. So, first thing, I will log into my Unity administration page. Oops. Now, in the Unity administration page on the left hand side, and this is your subscription section, subscribers, where you have subscribers, subscriber template, class of service, and so on and so. So the first thing we're going to, going to do, uh, based on customer requirement, is to customize certain settings so that every new user that we create will inherit these settings. So under subscriber template, you have uh, two templates that is exist. Uh, that can be used for both either administrator or uh, end users. Now this is an example of a, subscri a default subscriber template. You can change the name if you want to. And any settings that you define here will be available to any user account that was created based on this template. For example, if I want all the users to have belong to a um, particular time zone, I will go ahead and change the time zone here. So right now, Eastern time zone and if I want their name to be displayed or generated in a, through some sort of prompt I will say play the last name and then the first name if I chose not if I chose that user should not be part of a directory I can uncheck this so that their name will not be available during the directory search and when a user account is to be created in exchange well, how do you want the user accounts to be created as an alias? So these are some of the settings that you can define. Now the password, I will define uh, a, easy, uh, a simple password for example uh, for Windows. This is an example of how my internal password for all the phones are. Uh, it could be 5 digit, could be 11 digit, it all depends on your uh, company's policy. So in this case for example 5919 is a password for every new user that I create. So that's the that 5919 become a default password for everybody. You can also change the greetings and various other parameters. So I will go ahead and save this. Then on the subscriber, I will create a new subscriber. And when I do so, for example, test one, and I define what template I want to use. So I have two options either use administrator template or use a subscriber template. So, of course, I'll choose a subscriber because if I'm creating an end user's mailbox and all other parameters such as the extension the first name, last name, the display name and whatnot. So when you click on this it should create. Now uh, at this moment version 8 of Unity, Connect, uh, Unity 8 which is still in beta uh, is not able to create an ex uh, email account in exchange. You have to create it first and then import it into, ex into this particular Unity 8. So it's very important to understand that at the current stage you cannot create a mailbox and exchange account directly from Unity. First create the exchange account then import it into Unity and then create the mailbox. So that's the overview of uh, how to customize a subscriber template so that any changes you make will inherit it to any user that was created based on this template. Now any existing users will not be affected. It is only the new user that will be affected. 